Hi guys, what is going on and welcome to today's YouTube video. In today's video, we are going to discuss the current state of Bitcoin. We are going to look at potential scenarios that I might be looking to trade in the upcoming week. We know that today we have a national holiday in the US, so we might be seeing a little bit of a slow market today, especially during the New York session. But that doesn't mean that we can't already look for potential trade setups. So what I'm currently looking at for Bitcoin is a potential sweep into the liquidity. We can see that we got a sweep of the high over here. We can also see that if we switch on the relative strength index, is that Bitcoin is creating a bearish divergence on the daily time frame. So we are forming higher highs on the price section and we are forming lower highs on the RSI. To me, this is a signal that I don't want to be looking for long positions at the current area, especially since we are near peak resistance. I want to wait for a potential pullback before I'm going to be interested again into long positions. Currently holding this massive long position on Bitcoin. Let's see where I got the setup for you guys. I shared this setup. On every single social media that I have, I shared it in my Discord and I shared the exact setup in our VIP channel. And this setup so far is playing out beautiful. We hit our first day profit target and I'm looking to take the remaining of my profits out of this position around $27,000. Right now, I'm looking for a potential area where I can maybe open a new long position or where I can add towards my current long position. If I go on the daily time frame, I can see that we have our sell side liquidity on the daily time frame over here, in which we have a nice daily fair value gap that is yet to be filled below. So if I remove the daily time frame, if I'm going on the 12 hourly time frame, I can see that the sell side liquidity is very, very nice. I also want to take a look at the current fixed range volume profile. Because before I'm ever going to be interested in a potential long position, I want to see a sweep of the sales and liquidity over here. And this is where it gets kind of interesting, right? Because this is also where we see that we have our biggest volume spike and also our point of control exactly below our sales and liquidity, which is massive, of course. So if I'm also going to take a look at the Fibonacci retracement tool, in which we had a very nice sweep of the lows over here structure over here we can see that if we go from swing low to swing high is that we also have our golden fibonacci ratio at the exact same area our golden pocket is exactly where we also have our point of control and our 0.5 fib level is exactly where we have our previous low and we know that we always want to look to long within our discount and to short within our premium so the 0.5 fib level is actually indicating to us that we have a discount right below the previous low. So that will mean that we would see a sweep of the low into our discount where people will start selling out of fear, will start shorting out of the thoughts that we might be going lower since we broke the previous low. And that is exactly what we want to be seeing, right? Exactly what we want to be seeing is that we get a sweep of the low which makes people bearish into strong support and that is exactly the scenario that i'm currently looking at for bitcoin so if we also switch on our emas we can also see that also our 200 moving average and our 200 estimated moving average are both beautifully aligning with our area of interest so this point of control and this golden pocket in confluence with those strong emas is definitely an area to keep an eye on also on the 12 hourly time frame, we can also see that the 100 EMA is slowly approaching our area of interest. And then on the daily time frame, that we have our 200 EMA and our 200 uh, and our 50 moving average aligning with our area of support over here, which might be a nice area to potentially cover our stop loss. So this is definitely looking interesting to me. If we take a look at the fixed range volume profile of the entire range that Bitcoin has been trading in. We can also see that we have a massive value area high over here. And that value area high is also aligning with a sweep of those lows exactly within our area of interest. So definitely a very nice area of interest to look for potential long positions on Bitcoin. And I'm definitely going to keep an eye on this. If we get a sweep of the low, if we get the right reaction around this area, 
that is definitely where I'm going to be interested in potential longs. I think I might be waiting for a potential reaction first before setting any limit orders. So what do I want to be seeing, for example? I want to see a sweep of the lows in which we get a first bounce towards the upside. You never want to long that first bounce, right? You want to wait for a sweep of the first bounce because everyone that is longing that first bounce is putting their stop losses below that first low. So you get a sweep of that low and I want to wait for a break of structure afterwards in which we can enter a potential long position on the higher low play for Bitcoin. Okay, I think altcoins do look more interesting compared to Bitcoin for potential trading ideas. But I do think that if we get something like this, then I'm still going to be interested in potentially taking a position. Because this does look very, very interesting to me. And it does look in, like an area where I potentially want to add towards our current long position for Bitcoin. So definitely an interesting chart, pretty clean chart if you ask me as well. Also, if we look at a bigger volume profit, you can see definitely a massive volume spike exactly at our area of interest over here for Bitcoin which is very nice to be looking at and also over here we have a very nice volume spike at our area of interest this area over here where the demand was coming into the market is definitely the area that you want to be holding on to also because we have our break of structure at the exact same area over here this is definitely the area that you don't want to be losing for bitcoin in my opinion which could also act as a potential invalidation point okay this is what we're currently looking at for bitcoin if you guys have any questions after watching this short but detailed and very clear YouTube update, make sure to hit me up in my DMs on Twitter or to join a free Discord in which you can ask me all the questions that you want. Do wait for a nice reaction of this area before you start entering any long positions. Patience and discipline is what makes you a good trader. Always remember that. Let the setup come to you. Don't try to chase any setups. If I'm looking at the current price section over here, I am definitely not interested in taking any positions. Patience is key. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit up the like button. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I'll speak to you guys on Wednesday's video. Ciao, ciao.